Hey guys, how's it going? Today in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to fix your RGB fusion if it's looking like this when you open it. So we can see again, if I close it and I open RGB fusion, it's just going to look like this. So I'm going to show you guys a fix, how to fix this and get RGB fusion working again. So let's get started. All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to come here to control panel and we're going to go to uninstall program. Then we're going to scroll down until we find RGB fusion. It's going to look like this right here. And then we're going to right click and we're going to click repair. It's going to ask for permissions. We're going to click yes. And then we're going to wait for that to repair itself. Okay, just to verify that that repair took place, we're going to click on change next. We're going to go to next. We're going to click on repair. We're going to click next again. And we're going to click install. It's finished, so we're going to click finish. And there we go. All right, after we do that, we're just going to want to click on RGB Fusion, right click and do run as administrator. We're going to click yes, and then it should open up fine for us. All right, and the name of the game here is wait for like five minutes for the first boot after it got repaired, and it should open up fine. All right, after about two minutes of waiting for your first boot up into the app, um, it'll look like this, your normal, what you're used to, to seeing, an RGB fusion, and then of course you can come and pick the color of the things you want and apply it, and it should work like normal, so. So that's it for this video, that's how to repair RGB fusion 2.0 if it's not working for your motherboard. Um, thanks for watching, have a good one.